Hey, this is Bremster, and this is the next problem in my Sudoku problem series. This is killer crop key problem number one, where we're combining killer cages with crop key. Um, and this one is, was sent in by Neverio. Um, so with this one, um, again, you need to place the digits in cells marked with an X, um, same as with most of them so far, so, all of them so far, I think. Um, so, um, in, uh, there'll be a link to the problem below where you can try this if you want to uh, try it on a grid. Um, so with killer cages, the digit pl digits placed in the cages must sum to the number in the top left corner of the cage. Um, and the crop key dots is basically um, a digit separated by a black dot must be in a one to two ratio or one must be double the other. And um, digits separated by a white dot must be consecutive. That's what we've got for this one. Um, so let's see if you can figure this one out. Um, as I said, link below. Uh, I'll be back in a few seconds. Pause the video and I'll be back in a few seconds to uh, explain how this one works. Okay, so the way I like to think about this one, and this is the way I solved it, and I wasn't given another way to do it, is actually to use parity. So a 15 cage is an odd number. And what we know is um, because two consecutive um, digits will contain an even and an odd number, there's no way of putting two odd numbers together consecutively or two even numbers consecutively, this will be an odd number. So the total of this dot must be even. One, um, And there's only a couple of ways we can put um, digits together. One, two will be sum to three. That won't work. Um, two, four will sum to six, so that could work. So we could absolutely do two and four, and the order would be defined by this. Three, six would sum to nine, which would be an odd number, which wouldn't work. And the only other one we've got is four, eight, um, which we could do because four and eight sums to 12, and this would put an eight here. But either way, this is a four. Um, so we've automatically get a four from, uh, from the parity argument. Then we can start thinking about totals. Well, if this is four, two, then we've got six of the 15, these would have to sum to nine. But the only way you can get to nine with two consecutive digits is four, five. And we can't use the four because the four is already gone. So this has to be four, eight, four and eight sum to 12. These have to sum to three. So they have to be one and two. And the two here gives us the order. This becomes the one, this becomes the two, and that solves the problem. Very nice little one. Um, I'm labeling this one as definitely harder than normal. Um, I'm not sure if it's a medium or a hard. Um, yeah, if I get it wrong, doesn't matter. People can uh, figure that out for themselves. I'll probably label this one a hard because um, there's a couple of things to think about here. Uh, it may have been labeled as a medium. I'm not sure. Whatever matters is, I or whatever it comes out as, all that matters is I hope you're enjoying the series um, and that... Um, yeah, I. If you if you do have any suggestions or anything, if you've got any problems that you'd like to submit, please use my submission guidelines. Um, but yeah, thank you everyone for watching, and as always, good luck with your solving.